Now, I usually don't watch any of Pyro's videos, and if someone tries to post them on the NW Nation forums, I usually just delete them and sometimes even delete them. But the reality of it is, is that one person actually posted a video and I accidentally viewed it. And it was funny because these were the first words that came out of his mouth. First, I want to apologize to all of the multi-console owners out there. Everyone in this generation should be clear that the PlayStation 3 is the best console this generation. And by denying that, this makes you a fanboy. So, if I say the PlayStation 3 is the best console this generation, I'm not a fanboy. But if I say the Wii is the best console this generation, you know, especially since it surpassed all the consoles within sales, I am a fanboy. Hmm. So I'm not a fanboy if I say the PlayStation 3 is the best console this generation, but if I say the Xbox is the best console this generation, you know, despite the fact that, you know, it comes out with, you know, it pretty much changed the landscape of this generation's console gaming, I'm a fanboy. But I'm not a fanboy if I say the PlayStation 3 is the best console this generation. You know, I gotta say something. Either Paro is one of the most smartest men on this planet and he's trolling the hell out of all of us, or he is the d Hey guys, what's going on? Zephonix here, and that's right, that little jewel was from Pyro himself. Interesting, right? Interesting. So, what we're playing right now is Little Big Planet Kart Racing. Now, this is actually pretty good. I mean, I have no, no quirks about this game whatsoever. I mean, there was, I don't know, let's check it out. Let me show you, basically. Uh, so, we got story mode, community mode, recent activity, and of course, me. So, um, basically the story mode is just like the stories in Little Big Planet. You know, choose a level and then you can go ahead through here and there you go. Then you can go ahead, you know, then there's community, which community is obviously the, you know, the races that you've, you know I me. Mean. You have recent activity and then me. Now, for the record, just because I didn't say it right, community is basically, you know, where you can go ahead and get all the other tracks that were actually made. So that's actually pretty good here. So, give me one second, I'm turning on my mic a little bit. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. Now, there is a store right here where you can go ahead and buy stuff. And then I actually took a look here. This is also, a, this is your hub, of course, you know, your pod, if you will. You get to go ahead and, mod, um, and fix your character any way you want them or your cart. And which makes me, leads me to believe that there's a good chance that you can take all of the, um, you know, the outfits. Right now, I'm Sebastian. When I'm not whoever I want to create, I'm always Sebastian. But anyway, um, so that leads me to believe that you should be able to go ahead and use all of your original Little Big Planet outfits into Little Big Planet car racing, you know, which is actually pretty cool. You know, I actually personally think that perhaps they need to go ahead and focus on, um, ah, even better, focus on creating a Little Big Planet world instead of using it for home. You know, I'm just saying, you know, get rid of home, exchange it for Little Big Planet, you know, just create like a world like that. But that's for another video. So anyway, that's pretty much, um, and the carts are pretty much like this. You can choose between an actual cart that you can find in a story, or you can go ahead and modify your cart to your heart's content. So, for example, I can go ahead and click here. Ready yet? And then uh, for the suspensions, I can go ahead and modify it any way I want to. Give it treads or, you know, just regular a low rider. You know, things of that nature. Then I get to modify the wheels. Modify the seat. Which is irrelevant. Too, uh, not too, too irrelevant because you can't really see it. Uh, things of that nature. Button. And then modify the engine sounds. And then, of course, horn sounds. 
And that's pretty much it. So, I mean, it's actually pretty good. Okay, that's the modified, the actual pod. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. So, and then, you know, save your pods and all that stuff and decoration stickers. So, anyway, let's go ahead and um, check out a cart. Now, first one I'll do is I'll actually do a cart that's actually um, in the store line already here. So, let me see if I can find one here. Here we go. Uh, for this one, we're going to play on my own today. Just saying, because if you're doing a live video like this, you know, you never know what's going to happen or anything like that. So we're going to go ahead and just play on our own, make sure that we can actually get into a game here. Um, now, first thing I'm going to bring up is this. If you actually go ahead and take a peek here, you'll notice that. Um, give me a second. There you go. The, the load time isn't as much as it is in the other one, you know, in Little Big Planet 2. So. All right. So this would be considered a story mode right here. Now keep in mind, uh, if you haven't, if you haven't figured it out, this is an RC version. So the RC version, oh, this is hard to play while you're actually um, talking. What's about the RC version? So it's considered an RC program, you know. So that's already what makes this game cool, you know. And a lot of people are talking about, oh, this game is just like. Um, I actually forgot how to play this game. Mostly because I've never played an RC version of this before. But um, this one's like Super Sprint, you know, which I think is pretty cool. You know, so it plays just like Super Sprint. And I just used up all my turbos, so I have no turbos. And I can't, oh, I can't even, uh. Okay, so yeah, that was a real bad example to show <laughs> Because of the fact that I have never done like the RC version of that before. So, I mean, even though I only got in third place out of four. But, you know, that's fine. So, he, wait. Oh. So, which is fine. So, let's go ahead and jump into um, another one. So, that's that's one particular instance of what kind of racing you can do here in Little Big Planet Kart Racing. That's an RC version. That's basically the top-down RC Pro-Am slash Super Sprint slash whatever that other game was where you yeah all that so let's see it's like I'm almost, oh yeah, I'm almost afraid to actually do one here so what I'm gonna do is you know kind of redeem myself I'm gonna go back to one I did in recent activity here see if I can find oops not recent activity we're gonna go to me here and the sheer oh crud okay so I thought for a second I can go ahead and use one of my um one of my ones that I've actually um, was playing on before. However, it looks like I'm going to have to go find it. So I'm going to do a switch for Mario. Now, of course, I mean, when it comes down to these games, let's, let's put it out there. You know, you play these games because you can make Mario stages in them. You know, now why don't you want to just go ahead and buy Super Mario Kart is beyond me? Well, actually, I got an answer. Because you can actually um, hook, you can actually install an entire, like, seven or eight, whatever, on Super Mario um, Kart games into this one game. So, I mean, I guess in that sense, I can definitely go buy it. You know what I mean? Hey, you know, I buy it for $59.99. I got Super Mario Brothers, the original one, Super Mario Brothers, um, well, rather, Super Mario Brothers Kart, Super, you know, all those things, you know. So, this one is actually based off of the Super Mario Brothers, um, the Donkey Kong stage. So, I'm still not really sure what the, um, Still not sure what those bubbles are though, you know. I guess it's just for score. Now watch this. This is one cool part right here. I was like, yes. Watch this. I actually get the swing. <laughs> That's awesome.
Ah, oh, got me. <laughs> Where you think you were going? Okay. Not sure what happened there. That could have been a bug. So, and you guys, and guys who actually know me, you guys know I love these kart racing games, so. Oh, they got me. Okay. Alright, so not bad. I'm in fifth place so far. We'll see how far. Um... Ah, I tried to skid out and I couldn't. I could have actually just, I could have actually just jumped off that um, rope right there, but I decided not to. <laughs> you saw that? <laughs> no! Oh, no! <laughs> That's totally unfair. <laughs> All right. So you guys saw that I was almost in first place, maybe even in second place, but then I lost out. Okay. So you know, I gotta redeem myself. So. You know, and this game is pretty addictive, I gotta say that. But let's go ahead and see if I can redeem myself by replaying it here. Oh, that was funny. That was great. That was great. Okay, here we go. So there is a boost, apparently, when you first start. I gotta find out what it is. I'm assuming those those things are for points too, so. Oh crap, I missed it. Ah. Ooh, that was close, wasn't it? So try again. Now, if like if I, if I didn't tell you this already, I'm pretty sure I did. This is like a copy of the Donkey Kong stage. You know, this is a game. This is a board that someone else created. So I missed again. Crikey! No! <laughs> I had tried to dodge it. Okay, so where am I at? I'm, at? I'm in fifth place right now. Damn bug, man.
Alright, so let's go ahead and see. Oh, that's so messed up. <laughs> Alright, so I ended up in fifth place. Okay, fourth place. So let's go ahead and um, try a different one here and see if I can do better. I've actually seen a couple of them here. So come on, you can load, you can load, you can load, 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 you can load, you can load, you can load. Go. There we go. Okay. So like I said before. when it comes down to these things here, man, you already know they're going to make a whole bunch of Super Mario Brothers. Um stages here so let's see if we can find a better Super Mario Bros. stage here um so we saw we're not Royal Ra wait Royal Wasteway no that's I know what that one is oh unnamed to level zero good job buddy Mantra fan Sunset Meadow let's find some ah uh, we could do that but I mean let's be honest with you that's oh perfect This is actually a pretty good one. This one in Bowser's Castle. So, and I just saw Bowser's Castle, but I think we'll do our last race with this particular one here. So, okay. Oh, okay. This Luigi's Raceway. Okay. This is the, I think it's the one where he went into the tunnel and all that. Okay. It took me a second. I'm like, okay, this doesn't look familiar. I, think, I thought it was the other one. You know, the one where he starts off with him um, him and Daisy, whatever. Uh, maybe I could say it was obviously the wrong one. Okay, so I'm in fifth place right now. Okay, final lap in fourth place. Exactly where it was the last time. <laughs> All right, zit. Moment of truth. There you go. <laughs> Woo. Just in the nick of time, too. So like I said before, the, um, the game actually isn't bad at all. It's actually kind of fun. I mean, what you expect from a kart racing game. Do I think it's better than Mod Nation Racers? Actually, yes, I do. You know, but I mean, that's just to be said. I mean, so so it's pretty good here. I'm going to go ahead and hit, hit this with a uh, favorite and like. So, and there you go. That's pretty much um, the, what is it, Little Big Planet Kart Racing. It's definitely a pretty cool game. Uh, definitely no qualms, hates, or anything about it. It's actually pretty good. Now, like I said before, I suspect that, you know, most of the people who actually do play these kart games, you know, they a lot of them actually go ahead and get the Super Mario Brothers, um, you know, ones. And while they are Super Mario Brothers inspired karts, they really don't add up to the actual Mario Kart uh, experience. But nonetheless... It's still really good. I really did enjoy it. I definitely, excuse me, I definitely plan to pick this one up on first day. You guys have a good night. Zeph out.